Wow. This is a tribute and a farewell video to all the people and all the memories that I made while I was in Cleveland. Thank you. So one last adios and can't wait to see y'all in the future. Uh, and let's kick this vlog off with the summer cruise from last July. We gotta jump on the food, that's all I know. Right, Eduardo? Yeah? <laughs> oh my god, the line is absurdly long at the moment. Free concert. Kind of are old. Say hi to the vlog. Hey vlog. So, right now, Eduardo and I are running to the parking lot that we parked at because it closes at 11 and it's 10:55. So, just midnight jog in the middle of downtown Cleveland. Oh God, I don't want my car towed. Hopefully, I get the car. See you guys soon. I think we made it. I'm, I'm not sure though. The gate is closed, so hopefully it opens for us. Oh God, I'm sweating. I think we made it. Just gotta get out of the parking lot now. <laughs> Repeat what you said, Eduardo. Oh, we park near the boat. We walk 15 minutes downtown to get back to here where we were that first time, so. Late night tonight. Just got back from Costco after a large, large food run. We are having a lab barbecue. You know what that means? I'm gonna be grill master. Cooking up some hot dogs, hamburgers, you know, the shenanigans. Let me give you a sneak peek though into the food that we have. I have to do some lab work and then off to prepping for the barbecue. Cross my fingers, it's a good time. <laughs> First student run lab barbecue accomplished after a good two hours of running back and forth <laughs> to get lighter fluid, more charcoal to get these grills going. But it's been done. 2023 coming next. Barbecue was a success. About to head off to Little Italy for the Feast of Assumption. Pretty much like the Mardi Gras Cleveland at the moment. Gotta go, my blood demands it. Have myself some chocolate mousse and tiramisu. Had some meatballs from Bully and some galama. Good times, good times. I like your play, James. How you did you? <laughs> All the parties you hosted for Bianca. <laughs> Hug the left, you're too right. Congrats, my dude. Got that license, do you have it on you? It is that time of the year, right before school starts. Genetics department is doing a picnic, which means free food. You guys know me by now, free food is where I'm at. You hear that? Feels like Cleveland's going to war. Just casually riding my bike back from lab at eight o'clock at night. Gotta do this homework assignment for finance and watch these econ videos. Jesus, bro. Lord, help us all. That fresh haircut, getting compliments left and right. Didn't know I did it myself though. Guys, it's happening. I just submitted my first PhD application. Oh my Lord. I've got a sty, gotta put those warm compresses on. <sighs> Gave myself an undercut just a little bit, just a little bit, because you know what? Thomas Shelby vibes. I'll see you guys in Halloween. <music> Gotta love fall hikes. Oh, oh yes! Say hi. 
<laughs> Say hi. Some perfect fall weather, that's all I gotta say. 65. Leaves are golden. My lock is here. This ain't my bike. Someone stole my bike rack. It seems like in just one night, all the trees decided to drop their leaves. This is my bike ride every morning at the art museum right behind me. It's such a pretty ride. Oh my God, it gets so dark so early now. It's like 30 degrees, only 545, and it is pitch black out. Pitch black, this is insane. It's insane. We decided to do a Friendsgiving. So I ran out to the grocery store to pick up just instant stuffing, instant gravy, a ham that'll be cooked in like 20 minutes. This, this goes against my entire <laughs> cooking identity. We'll hopefully pull a Friendsgiving off. Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. Sometimes you snowfall of Cleveland, Ohio. A lot of pros and cons to winter. I am so happy that I just got brand new tires two days ago. So now I'm not slipping and sliding all over the road. But yeah, the beauty of snow is, is one of those pros. And I have 30 minutes to get to my finance class. Hopefully I don't get mugged while uh, riding my bike. I am two hours behind schedule leaving Cleveland to go back to Jersey. Hopefully traffic isn't too bad, but knowing Thanksgiving rush, it will be. We are back in Jersey. Just a, a measly six hours, no bathroom break, no gas break, just a full ride all the way. Probably looking like a mess right now, but I hope y'all have a great time with your families and happy Thanksgiving. 23 pound turkey. <laughs> My first pie I've ever made. And these are the slice. It looks crispy. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> this has been a very good Thanksgiving weekend. Went golfing with the high school boys yesterday, which, gosh darn it, it's been like a year and a half since I've seen them. Nice chilly round. And yeah, now I am about to do a Friendsgiving with the Ramapo gang. Good times, good times. We got Mediterranean. Oh, all the guys. Morristown. That's what this is. <laughs> so, we're at the end of this, and guess who orders chicken nuggets? This guy. It's like a Christmas brunch. down to a sheet of number four. I don't know what the mill is on that, but we're number four on the machine. And then goes our pasta sheet. Out comes our fettuccine Alfredo, soon to be no problem. Look at this beauty. Look at that, perfect every time. Well, uh, it's a little windy. It is 65 degrees out right now in the winter and have to enjoy it on a Sunday. So went out taking nature pics, you know, with the new camera. So, the donation did not work. They missed my vein a couple times, which are kinda, <laughs> kinda hard to do. Not sure how they did it. And then finally, when they thought it worked, they ended up uh, sticking saline within my body and not my vein. But now I have complete swelling, this huge apple-sized bump in my forearm. This is insane. One second, you'll see. 
I don't know if that's healthy or not. Look at it compared to my arm. Oh my God. We got Cavs Knicks. <laughs> who, who, who do we got winning, Daniel? Cavs, for sure. Cavs? How about these two? Cavs or Knicks? Cavs. Nah, Knicks. Knicks for the win. <laughs> Ladies and gents, please tell me what happened. What was the end result for the same one? Cavs, Cavs did not win. Jalen Brunson scored 50 points. Laid to it, oh my God, my voice. Completely laid to waste the Cavs. Go Knicks, even though I'm not an NBA fan at all. Villanova. Hey, hey, hey. Is a fantastic Sunday outside. At the moment I am doing some nature photography and about to read this new book. We'll see if it's good. Only time will tell. All right, y'all, we are doing it. We are going to click the submit button for Vanderbilt. I accept. Look at that. I got that Vanderbilt acceptance. Brandon, None. can you volunteer for this ball? You're going to give tickets? How about you, Daniel? The aviators are going on today. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think it was six o'clock that you guys were supposed to volunteer. You know what's crazy is that you can change the time zone like on your iPhone. That's a good point. Have you learned from Gordon Ramsay? Yeah, you do. Daniel, Daniel's got the riz, doesn't he, Sam? <laughs> How was the night, boys, after? Sorry, you too. <laughs> This fat munchkin. Are you with your club? <laughs> yeah, for like, you know, photo shoot. For memories. There you go. We're gonna put that on your resume. Yeah. I have flash. Damn, dude. A, a before and after of this weekend. So. I am in lab, just wrapped up uh, changing some media. Uh, last night was fun, listening to 2 Chains at the uh, Spring Fest uh, concert, and about to head to Sandusky to go to an Airbnb on the lake before heading to the genetics retreat on Monday. So you guys will see some fun stuff here and there, I guess. And we're here, guys. Look at this. This is amazing. Oh, look at the birds. Oh, Isabel, you scared them. This is so freaking cool. What do you want to do? I want to live here forever. Same. Oh, this is the kids' rooms? Oh, look at the kids. Isabel, Bianca, what are we having? Chicken stroganoff. Chicken stroganoff. It is different from the Russian stroganoff. It's very different. It's the Brazilian version, the best version. That doesn't look like rice, it's Bianca. Garlic. Um, garlic and onions. It's an interesting technique. Frying the rice and then boiling it. I'll have to do it. Chicken stroganoff. <laughs> no, my nose doesn't fit this hat. Oh, okay, there we go. We're looking good. There we go. We got it. This is going on the vlog, so it's a photo <laughs> that I can take a screenshot of. Daniel, what did you think this was? A mouse. A mouse. It's a Happy birthday to you. Oh my. Today was a hectic, hectic day. Came in at 9, left at 10. Just one thing after the other. But. Got a lot done. Finally out of there. <laughs> Look at this champ. Out here driving my car to come snag me at 11 o'clock at night. 
and we are out of here again at 9 30 two nights in a row that's very awkward to try to do that i'm tired i'm not sleeping right and i'm not eating right Whew. all right well catch you all around wish me luck hopefully i don't get shot adios Well, that was insane. I spent about 30 minutes just in traffic waiting for the grad students and then just decided to turn around and go another way. What am I doing? Why am I still here? <sighs> I've been pulling these 13, 14 hour days and I have no clue why. At least I have my bike so I can zoom on by East Cleveland and get back home within like 10 minutes. Get some food in, work out maybe at like 12 o'clock and we're good. Story time. Okay, so this wedding wiped me out. I was dead for like the first two days and I ended up having to sleep 14 hours last night. Those 14 hours came in handy. And why is that? Right now you can see behind me, it is pretty dark. It is 3.30 in the morning. I will be seeing the sunrise. I've stayed late nights, but it's a first for everything. And I am pulling my first all-nighter at Case Weston. Uh, these energy levels may be coming crashing down very soon. I did get in a little bit late, Sometime soon, who knows when. This is just rambling at the end. This is a minute, wow. 4.30 and it is still dark out. And as far as I can tell, no one is here. Is anyone over in the shaver lab? Nope. I'm gonna draw something. I just realized it's not just my first all-nighter at lab. It's my first all-nighter in general. I'm a little delirious. So it is looking like the sun is coming up, not as dark. We have made it to sunrise. We are attempting banana bread with these very ripe bananas. Uh, wish me luck. We'll see if it comes out good. to give birth, all right, yeah. Cedar Point for the first time. Here we go before we head out. Experience. We did not get red. Yet. Well, yeah, that we don't know. That we don't know. It was a great last thing to do a weekend before I head out. So, if you're in Ohio, go to Cedar Point. That is so ominous. <laughs> Pulled another all nighter, and this was my bed. Editing this vlog made me realize all the great memories I made while I was in Cleveland. So this is kind of a tribute video to all the people I met and all the memories we were able to create together. Thank you. I'm very grateful for the time that I had. And if you have the opportunity to move away from home for a couple years to work uh, and meet new people, take those opportunities. You will not regret it. So thank you Cleveland and thank you to the Miranda Lab and everyone else that I met in between. Um, God bless and I hope everyone has a blessed life. Because it's the holiday season too, I am hopefully going to be able to get a couple more videos out within this next month or so. Keep your eyes out for a wedding video and for uh, the trip to Korea. So uh, I'll keep you guys updated and till next time.